2 g 3 g 4 g are the common terms that we use in our regular conversations and uh, if you follow news then recently 5g services have been launched in india and uh, airtel 5g services are released in major cities like bangalore hyderabad delhi mumbai etc now uh, airtel also confirmed a pan india rollout for 5g by 2024 so um, you know in this in this video it's, a, it's an attempt to understand what these generations are all about what exactly is 1g 2g 3g 4g and 5g so keep watching the developments in telecommunication is what we call generations the 1g or the first generation allows us to uh, you know communicate only through voice calls and the quality and the battery life of 1g is very low now it is introduced in 1980s and Japan is the first country to be fully connected with 1G. As the technologies got advanced, now we have 2G in the 1990s. 2G or the second generation in telecommunication allows us to use voice calls and SMS. Uh, it has better quality life and better uh, battery life comparative to the first generation and the devices started getting uh, the size of the devices started getting smaller comparative to the first generation and Finland is the first place to be introduced to 2G services. In 2000s, we are introduced to smartphones which has an access to third generation technology or what we call as 3G. Now 3G allowed us to use voice calls, SMS, MMS, images, GIFs and mobile uh, internet. Now with mobile internet, we, ha we also had an access to use uh, video calling, live streaming, etc, etc. Now 3G is first introduced in Japan but commercially launched in South Korea. At this stage of technology, the users started paying based on the data transferred and not the time. With further developments in the technology, we arrived at 4G or the 4th generation and India is uh, having a large user base which is connected with 4G network services. Now 4G enabled a dramatic increase in download and upload speed and one can see a, a, a drastic increase in the mobile speed, uh, mobile internet speed as well. This enabled video calling with multiple people, uh, HD quality live streaming and HD quality mobile television. 3D television was possible and there has been a huge development in the gaming industry as well. And in 2022, India is introduced to 5G or the 5th generation technology. It is anticipated that we can see its applications in virtual reality and uh, we, one can also anticipate advancements in robotics and artificial intelligence. It is also said that it's going to affect mechanical industry um, because robots will be able to do human works and robots will take over the jobs of humans such as cutting, slicing, packing with the help of 5G technology. And a lot also has been said about medical industry that robots will be able to uh, you know remote uh, will be able to do remote operations and remote surgeries with the help of 5g technologies in a scenario as such in society we can see dual opinions few people believe that technology and advancement of technology is the only way forward to solve uh, many problems uh, whereas few people believe that it is a danger to humanity and it does more bad than good so I, I am really interested to know about your views so please comment your views in the comment box below if you like this video please like share and subscribe to